All right, let's do it. Here we, here we are again. Next up, we're back, we're back. And I'm going to check out what's in that tackle box with the lock pick that I have. What's in you? Open says me. And, oh, it's an antique coin. Oh, that's not too bad. I mean, okay, that's two I have. I can't remember how many I had with Ethan. Maybe like three or four. So that would be enough to get the stabilizer. I just want two more, I think, to be safe. Oh, hey, there, there's the safe point. There's the TV. Uh, so what do I need to do now? Repair the elevator. I need to go to the third floor sick bay. I don't know where the sick bay is. Oh, <gasps> chem fluid. Let's make some first aid with that. Because we do have a good amount of bullets. Well, not really a good amount. But we do have strong bullets, so that's something at least. Who's getting goopy over there? Oh, I can make it to the sick bay now because I have the corrosive. Okay. Things are working out pretty good. I'm going to use my first aid to top off my health because I don't know what's behind this door. Corrosive. Still got two of those left. I don't know what other corrosives we need. Ooh, this is dark. Back. I forgot it was not an action game. It's a horror game. Oh. Okay, that's a kind of... That is an awesome view. I love the detail on this. That is so cool. Great job. Great job. Great job, Capcom. You did a good job with this. <laughs> so, let's make sure we don't miss anything. Can't really see much in the dark. I mean, I do have that lucky flashlight, so... At least that's something. <gasps> Ooh, that's a gooby. That's a gooby boy. That's a big boy. Big boy. Would you... Dead. <laughs> oh, nope, 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 nope. Hey, you want another bomb? Oh, walk in your puke. Hey, can you walk a couple steps forward? Thank you. Are you dead? Oh, come on! Did you die already? Die! Ouch! Your dumb vomit. Quit eating so much. Crap! Oh, 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 I think you're down! Yep, that's... <laughs> that's it for you. Okay, I need these wires. Give me the wires. Give me the wires. I need this for the elevator, please. Power cable, there we go. Okay. Okay, we're doing good, doing good. Give me that corrosive. I need those for the doors. Please tell me there's some medicine back here. Because it is the sick bay. Uh, or at least some... M fluid or something. Oh! Oh, just thought I needed uh, let's make strong bullets with that, and first aid. Oh, I can... What's in this? Nothing! A great big nothing. Alright. Okay. These remote bombs are amazing. What? What? How is this door stuck? Darn it. Okay, so this... We now have about 31 bullets. It's a good amount. That can probably take four or five guys down. Alright, I need to go back to the elevator, and I need to put these cables in so I can get to the bottom floor and get to my bro, Ethan. It's weird playing as Mia. I don't even know why. I guess, it, I guess this was just to give more exposition to Mia and Evelyn's backstory. Hippity hoppity. Hippity hoppity. Wait, what? Uh oh. Oopsie. Oh. Well, I was. That was weird. I got stuck. Uh. Where, wait, where'd I go? Oh. Let's try that again. Whee! There we go. Uh, no, I don't want to put the fuse. Put the fuse and put the cable. There we go. Elevator work now. Okay. So, which floor do I need to go to? No, not two floor. I. No, not... Darn it, I hit the wrong button. 
I need to go to the basement. Basement, do you understand? Okay, I'm gonna switch out into my good bullets. Oh, that's nice. Basement, that's where I need to go. And I've got a good amount of corrosive. I've got, got some herb. I think I'll be good for the fight. He's waiting. Cause I have a feeling. Well, maybe I should keep him waiting. Okay. Oh, I see you up there. What are you gonna do there? Buster Brown? Three shots and you go down. Yeah, that's it for you. Hey, we're okay. What's in here? Strong camp fluid. Can't make bullets, so I'll make strong first aid med. Remote bomb, good. I don't like your crescendos. Nope. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I got you. What you get? Okay, we need to get in here, but first let's actually go in here. There might still be stuff. Yep. Thought so. Machine gun ammo, that's good. More machine gun ammo. And some remote bombs. There we go. Oh, what's in here? And gun ammo, okay. So we are we're getting ready for a big fight, I guess. Okay. How are you doing, Evelyn? I'm just fine, thanks for asking. Is that a big fatty? No, it's a big boy. Not the... Yeah, it's a skin. Okay. I'm using all my strong bullets. Run back! Down and he oh hey blew up the chest for me. Machine gun ammo. I think I'm okay for now. I'm gonna keep myself at low health. You know what? Open the door. Anybody goopy in here? I got a ton of machine gun ammo. What's in this? Corrosive curiosity. What's in here? Another antique coin. I like it. Okay, Ethan's probably in there, but let's go see if there's anything more in here. As I said, another corrosive I can use. More corrosive. Okay, a couple remote bombs. It's a good trade-off, I think. How many remote bombs do I have? Three. Uh... <laughs> I think I've got everything I need. All right. Let's do it. Hi there, Evie. Something. What do you need me to do? Ethan. Well, I'm getting Ethan out of here. Or maybe not. I'm just going to say, Ethan, and just let him Ethan. die. Oh. Ooh. Ethan. He's still alive. Hey, shh. shh. I know, I know, I know. I'm not going to hurt you. Hell, Hi, I Jack. would have if I could have helped you. What do you mean? Oh. I'm no killer, son. Neither is Marguerite, nor my boy Lucas, or even Zoe here. That girl, Evelyn, she did this. What the hell is she? Oh. Now, what did she do to you? She infected us with her gift. Guys. That's what she calls it. I found her near a busted out tank in the bayou. Everything changed after that. So she infects you and then she takes control? 
No. Not exactly, son. She just... She forces a way into your mind, your soul. You can't fight back. Aww. You are connected to her, and you can't resist the urge to... Oh, you're a, you're a different person after that. Just like Mia. Aww. So Mia sent me that message because of Evelyn. Listen, uh, a girl just wants a family of her own. She's the key. All right? You find her, and you stop her. I'll do it, man, for you. Free my family. Please. Oh no, that's so sad. Oh, I feel bad for Jack now. Okay, so it Jay, seems like away from him. Why? Oh. He doesn't love you. I can make him love you. Don't Don't hurt him. Silly, I told I'm a good you boy. I'm not gonna hurt him. Don't you dare. So what? <laughs> You're not my mom. Remember? Can I get out of this? This is a nice view. Oh. Oh, she's getting me out. Hi, Mia. Mia. Mia, how? There's no time. You have to get out of here and find her. Here. But she's Take right this. there. What? Oh, yes, yeah, the vial. Wait, what no! are you doing? What are you doing? Saving your life. Just got. You need to go. I won't be able to resist for much longer. No. Now go back to that little bitch. No. No. Mia! No! Oh. Okay, you little bitch. Where the fuck are you? Okay, there we go. I like this. Badass Ethan. Oh, I just have nothing. I have tissue samples, but I don't have my stuff. It's all your fault. Uh, well, yeah, you brought me here, so it's kind of all your fault, not me. Oh. Oh, it's the outside bayou. It's the non-baker <laughs> farm. So it seems like Jack and Zoe were stuck in Evelyn's hive mind. So she takes over your bodies, and you, your consciousness is put into the hive mind, where she controls you, but you stay in there. So that wasn't Jack attacking you. That wasn't Marguerite, nor Lucas, or even Zoe, I guess. I guess she's been taken over. But it wasn't them. It was Evelyn that took over them. Okay, I understand now. I understand makes sense so these people oh oh a bunch of dead fish i'm sorry fishies i ain't gonna be sleeping with you tonight no sir oh it's reminiscent of the beginning so i think we're getting really close to the end <sighs> boopity 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 yes Oh, you can now carry more items. Oh, I got the expert backpack. Okay. Uh, am I going to get my stuff? Abercrombie Salt Mine, South Delvey. Enhanced gun ammo. February 18th, 1892. There was a collapse in the Patterson Mine. Tuan and Beckford are dead, and Huxley will never walk on his own again. Old Man Stan was right. The ground there is too unstable. February 19th, 1892. The company's not going to send us any replacements. They want us to work double shifts instead. Can't wait to get back to the old country. Okay. I didn't miss any files, did I? No? No? Does that even count as a file? Was I supposed to find the rest of the files as Mia? What's this? It's a plane. 
Are they watching us from that helicopter? Psycho stimulants. Am I supposed to read this? Is that... <clears throat> Excuse me, darn it. Oh. Alpha 1, this is Bravo 1. Do you read? This is Alpha 1. Yeah. Report. Did you find anything? A thorough search <gasps> of the Baker property revealed zero survivors. Repeat, zero survivors. We did find evidence of a skirmish. Evelyn? Negative. However, we did find several encrypted messages from the Baker's son, Lucas, to an unknown third party. You can probably guess oh. who that was. That's just great. We've had reports he's in the abandoned mine south of the property. I'm gonna go have a look. Roger that. We'll meet you at those coordinates. If you encounter Evelyn, orders are shoot to kill. Repeat, shoot to kill. Oh, I think that was Chris Redfield. Hey, I'm back. All right. Is this all my stuff? You've taken me as things. Oh, cool. Ah. Uh -huh. Well, we do have a lot of machine gun ammo. Um, let's bring. Uh. Should I bring the four? Okay. First of all, I'm going to bring. The survival knife. I do need that. I'll bring my... I kind of want that Albert 04. Or OR. That'll be probably be better used for the handgun ammo. It seems to be a more powerful gun, at least. And then I'll take... Do I have any other enhanced ammo? Machine gun ammo. I'll take that. I'll take... The P-19 machine gun, the other machine gun ammo. I'll take Secrets of Defense, the M-21 shotgun, shotgun shells. I don't even have any. <laughs> uh, and all I have for first aid is that. And that is it. <gasps> Wait, but I have eight anti-coins. That's just enough to get the rest of these. Okay, 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 okay. Let me just use these and get the rest of these. All right. Give me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nice. Okay. So we now have steroids and... Apparently... Wait. Uh... Do I have any more steroids and such? Another stabilizer. Oh, I have to use them one at a time. Let's use it. <laughs> yeah! And a steroid. Oh, that was my he max health. Oops. I feel great. Okay. Maybe use it again. And do I have any more steroids? There, right? Okay, let's use him again. We're gonna be so jacked. No, no! Did I just put that up? Crap. Also, do I want to bring the 44 Magnum? Haboom! <laughs> okay. Alright. I think I'm good to go. If I find anything outside, I'll use the psycho stimulant, see if there's anything outside. Good. Yum yum. Whee! Oh, there's stuff right there. Burner fuel. Okay, well, I don't need that. Poor machine gun ammo. Welcome. Welcome, machine gun ammo. Bye bye. Okay, let's go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. I want to see all the stuff I can find. All the stuff that there is. And the. Uh, 44 Magnum. Ah, uh, okay, if I get a little... I think I should probably use that. And strong chem fluid. I can hear the goopiness, but... I'm gonna take out the 44 Magnum just because I think I should. Because I've been saving that up for a special occasion. Uh, let's...
herb, make that. Put up the rest of the herbs. Take out the gunpowder. Where is the gunpowder? Gunpowder. There you go. And make more enhanced ammo. Crap! I need that 44 Magnum. Okay, I need the Magnum ammo. What can I put up? I'll put up the excess handgun ammo, take the Magnum with me, and then is there anything else that I can take? Uh, I do kind of want to have the remote bombs. You know what? I'll put up put up more handgun ammo and substitute them for the bombs. Okay, we are good to go. We are good to go. We are juiced and ready. All right, this is going to be some fun. Uh -uh. Oh, somebody getting goopy over there. Somebody's goopy over here. Over here. Over here. Oh, somebody's getting goopy right here. Hey, what are you three doing here? A four? Batteries are low. I should have. Jiminy Christmas. Do I have any space now? Okay. Gonna have trouble reloading. I'm gonna lose all my handgun ammo, but uh, that's okay. This is fine. Oh, there's a button. I should probably press that. Nope. Shotgun shells. All right. What's this? Strong chem fluid. I do want to take that, but I can't. I think I'll be okay. I think I shall be okay. Keep. Got a lot of ammo. Got... A little bit of health. I'm just gonna have to be really smart about this. I've got some bombs too. Got a lot of shotgun shells. Got a ton of before ammo. Okay. Okay. Okay, you butt brains. Let's do it. This packs a ton of punch. Nope. 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 <laughs> Oh my goodness. Yeah, I hate those crawly guys. Should have switched to the shotgun. Let's just boop. And the boop. Handgun ammo. Oop. Let's switch to good ammo. Woo! Somebody blew up. That's good. Oh, just watch. Oh! Watch your dumb head. Woohoo! Put my leg back together. Hold on, guys. Ah! 
Good lordy! Lordy! You don't even have arms! Jiminy Christmas, and I'm already out of health stuff! I don't have my chem fluid. I should have taken that. But I'm just a little dummy. Oh well. Which one's my enhanced? That's the enhanced. That I don't have the enhanced on right now. I should probably have the enhanced on. Boop. Hello? Hello? Anybody in there? 44 Magnum ammo. How much ammo do I have for that? <gasps> Crap, I forgot to take the 44 Magnum ammo. Darn it. Oh, I screwed up. Dang it! That would have been like seven shots! I was willing to use it for the Evelyn. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh! Nope! Oh! No! Can I go back to my last save point? That would be nice. Four-legged, molded piece of garbage. I messed up and I didn't take the 44 Magnum ammo. No! <laughs> ah! No! We're still stuck. Okay, he's down. Let me just. You know what? I'll take this one out. But I'll leave these two alone. Come on, bring your dumb head over here. There we go. Ah. Why didn't you shoot him? There we go. Okay. Oh man, I messed up. Wait, I need those shotgun shells. I need those shotgun shells. Thirty-one. Okay. Deedly deedly dee. I'm making my way. Let's switch that with the remote bombs. There we go. <sighs> Just a guy trying to make his way in the world, not asking for much, but getting a bunch of shit in return. Gotcha! <gasps> what? <gasps> That's how I thought. Couple of remote bombs, that's good. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Trottly doddly da, deedly dee. We just. Boop. Boop. Oh. oh, you want some of this? Boop. Oh, you're still alive. Load one, two. I think he's dead. Nope. Okay. 
Hello? Am I supposed to push it the other way? Because I think I need to push it into the gate, maybe? Get a running start. Use your calves. Use your thighs and your muscular calves. Kaboom. Tra la 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 la. Anything over here? Nope. Nope. Can't get to anything over there. Nope. Hey! We made it somewhere. Maybe there'll be a save box. Lucas, you sneaky piece of garbage. You piece of garbage. Yeah! You're not getting me that one, Lucas. Ooh. Uh, okay. Sent. Friday, January 16th, 2015. 12.42 a.m. Thanks to you guys, it's been about a week since my head's been clear and back to normal. And she still thinks she got me. You guys really need to work on fixing that. Not only does she look a little like a little kid, but she's about as stupid as one, too. Mom and Dad are still totally under, though. I was wondering, is this whole family obsession something you guys programmed into her? Into her? It's kind of fucked up. <gasps> this is Lucas, isn't it? Sent. Friday, November 4th, 2015, 2 10 a.m. That bitch Mia is still somewhere in between Evie La La Land and reality. She gets pretty violent, so I locked her up in a cell. I thought maybe Evelyn would get mad since Mia's her favorite and all, but she doesn't seem to care. She has to go and visits her sometimes. She thinks Mia's her mommy. Like I said, your bioweapon? Fucked up. Sent. Friday, September 1st, 2016, 1 10 a.m. Evelyn's family obsession is getting out of hand. She's making everyone kidnap more and more assholes off the street and to add to her freak show of a family. Maybe she's getting tired of me and not coming around, but it's a pain in the ass for me because I gotta clean up the mess whenever someone new comes along. By the way, Evie's looking sick or something. Her skin's getting all wrinkly, and she's getting gray hair. So is that supposed to happen? It's almost like she's getting old all of a sudden. So Lucas was cured. Lucas was cured this whole time, but he's just a jackass. Thank you, Lucas, for being stupid. Okay, Lucas was never infected. Oh. Oh man, I missed a, I missed two files. Not her butters, man. Maybe I didn't? Hello? The report details the symptoms that a this report details the symptoms that appear when the bacterium that grows inside of the ear series infects a human. Be sure to read this document thoroughly before dealing with the E-series weaponized assets, hereafter referred to as mold. Initial infection. The mold ingests ingredients from the subject's body to pro prognate itself, and it slowly takes over the cells within the body. As a side effect of this, this infected subject gains remarkable regenerative abilities. During experiments, we removed arms and legs from the tech subjects and found that they were able to co-opt the amputated limbs in a matter of minutes. Mid-stage infection. Once the mold reaches the brain, the subject's thoughts become in tune with those of the E-series accent. The subject starts to hear things and experience hallucinations and soon comes under the complete control of the E-series asset. If the state continues, the host will lose all si sense of ego. Complete infection. After every cell in the body has been taken over by the mold, the subject begins to lose their human form. Physical mutations differ from case to case, but all result in him or her requiring incredible physical strength. Containing a subject at this stage would be extremely difficult. Well, they seem to get stuck behind doors pretty easy. Ah, oh, man. Oh, that's one of them. I just need one more. One more file to read, please. What's this? Okay. <gasps> oh. Can I read this? E-necrotoxin. Oh, it's the thing that Mia had. Destroy cells of any subject based on the E-series bioweapon model. Use only for exposal of E-series assets. This toxin must be first stimulated before use. Do this by placing a sample of an E-series cells into the necrotoxin container. A boop. I did it. Yes! That was, that was the one I was missing. All right. Ooh. E-necrotoxin. So this is how I kill Evelyn. So she was the grandma. Was there Emma or grandma in the, in the first place? Because they never mentioned her by name. And do I get... What's this? Evelyn's functions also include the ability to form organisms from mice. 
mycelia, the fungal filaments. The term organism is used loosely here. Strictly speaking, there are suborganisms formed of countless mycelia. What's important, though, is that they exhibit a strong survival instinct and will defend themselves ferociously with the slightest provocation. Their fungal toughness and remarkable strength give them significant battlefield potential. These researchers have been calling these superorganisms the molded, made of mold, and also molded as in shaped. The name has a certain elegance to it. For the treatment of accidental infections performing on samples of Evelyn's body tissue produces a unique fungal fungicidal serum. Administering the serum to an infected subject will cause the mycelia to calcify, but the if the subject's cells are already largely invaded, the serum will be fatal. So that's what happened to Jack. Since the treatment window is so small, the serum's primary use is therefore disposal of infected subjects rather than a cure. In exploring the serum's potential, we found that subjecting it to blank would enhance its effects to extreme potency. Become a, compo a compound we now call e necrotoxin, which blank in even tiny amounts. What's been in interesting to observe in Evelyn's behavior is her obsession with the concept of family. In experiments, we found on multiple occasions that infected subjects were compelled to act as her mother or father, treating her as if they were really, she were really their daughter. Why did she settle upon family as the theme for a mental control? Okay, this is just speculation, but it, could it be that she instinctively understands that a family unit is better suited to b blending into social groups than a lone girl? On the other hand, well, a sentimental sort of might suggest that she's making up for a perceived Perceived lack of love in her quarantine upbringing, a parent's love. Nah. Oh, 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 I'm missing a report. Two of two. Where's the other report? There it is. Yes, my beautiful file. The project was instigated in 2000 as one of several concepts for the company Nextbus, Next Generation Experimental Battlefield Battlefield Superiority Initiative. Working with technical assistance from HCF to develop a bioweapon for neutralizing combatants en masse with minimal direct contact. Nexbus was later folded and all its assets diverted to this project. What makes the project markedly different from conventional weapons is its ability to turn enemy combatants into allies, converting hostile elements into willing servants. Since this effectively eliminates the cost of only POW handling, but also combat itself, it's no wonder we had blank and even blanks and blank organization chomping at the bit to get on the board. Probably Umbrella. The project would never have existed if it were it not for the discovery in blank of blank, the remarkably progressed vicariant evolution fungus that we commonly term the mutamocyte. The fabrication method for each bioweapon was to introduce the mutamocyte genome to a pre-stage 4 human embryo and perform cultivation in a control environment over a period of 38 to 40 weeks. The resultant organisms were referred to as candidate specimens and graded based on usability from impractical and faulty series A through D to the perfected E series. A common appearance was selected for the bioweapons, that of a roughly 10-year-old girl, to ensure the ease of blending in with urban refugee populations. The first E series specimen named Evelyn has proved capable of secreting the mutism site blank from her tissue as well, at will. It is also, also note of Evelyn's mutamocyte imposes a profound control over body and mind when introduced to a ho host organism. We still have a lot to learn about the mechanism by which Evelyn achieves and maintains this control, but the working theory is that the vector is similar to the autoinducer pheromones used for quorum sensing in Pseudomonas bacteria. Evelyn's control is exerted in a series of discrete stages, the first of which is hallucination. Almost immediately after infection, infection the subject begins to see images of Evelyn, though she is not in fact there, and even hear her voice, which is inaudible to everyone else. Aud auditions with infected subjects throughout the stages of the infected reveal that at first the phantom Evelyn appears to be a normal young girl, sometimes desiring companionship or assistance. As time progresses, she begins making more and more extreme demands, including self-mutilation and attacks on other people. The psychological shock that induces to help break down the mind's natural barriers to Evelyn's brainwashing effect and the... And by the time mental control is achieved, the mutamocyte infection has progressed through the body cell, so the body blank. Ugh. Yay! I read more stuff. Okay. Okay. <gasps> yes! I get a second chance! Take your magnum ammo, dummy! 
Okay, so that's six. I need to load this up. And then I'll put the bombs back. Nope, put the, bo put the bombs back. There we go. Uh, do I have any chem fluid? I don't think I do, but I'll bring psycho stimulants with me. Take down Evelyn. And my controller died. That was my bad. Oops. My bad. Okay. Anything else I need? Uh, herb. Got a bunch of herbs anyways. Any health? Use those steroids in the diff- Oh. Flame rounds. No, thank you. Let's actually use some psychostimulants. It's here. Hi. Enhanced gun ammo and... You have the knife to get away from me? Oh. I'm going to go the other way. Oh, something's over here. Neural rounds. No, don't need that. Apola, I'm just trying to find all the good stuff. All the goodies. I want the goodies. Did I miss something right here? What did I miss? Steroids! Yay! Oh, it feels so good. It feels so good. I think I'm gonna get addicted. Your max health increased. I am gonna be ready for Evelyn's fight. I don't know about me. I don't know about anybody else, but. Hello? What is this? More neuro rounds, so maybe they're wanting me to use it against Evelyn. Oh, it's a little pokey guy. There we go. He blew up. Oopsie. There's my knife. Shotgun shells. Yay! Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Let me switch this back with the bombs. Crap. Okay, getting ready to go into the final battle. All right, I'm gonna save here, and then I think next is gonna be the last episode of Resident Evil 7. This is gonna be the first horror game, adventure game, with a story that I'm gonna be completing, and that's gonna be awesome. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please like the video. It really helps me out. And a subscribe if you're new. But I will see you later. And we will take down Evelyn together. Have a good night, guys.